Hello everyone, and welcome to my bold and beautiful 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Sheila responds to Deacon's proposal, and Finn surprises Steffi at home with amazing news. Hope tells Finn that she is still waiting for the shock to wear off. She did not expect to see Sheila when she stepped in. She can only image how he's feeling. Finn explains that he has been mourning her death for weeks, and they now have another chance to be in one other's life. Hope warns that Steffi despises Sheila and may not comprehend his feelings. She feels Finn should be practical. Finn admits that a lot has transpired, but he refuses to hate or punish her. I am her son. We have a connection. Hope wonders how he thinks Steffi will respond when he informs her Sheila is alive. At Forrester, Liam and Steffi chuckle about Kelly forcing her to buy toys. Liam claims she tattooed a big fairy on his back with permanent pen. Steffi laughs and wonders what she would do without him. Thank you for taking my mind off of Sheila. She is aware that she has died, yet she is unable to stop the flow of thoughts in her mind. Liam assures her that she cannot injure her and that she no longer has authority over her. Steffi adds, or Finn. Outside Deacon's home, he proposes to Sheila on bended knee. Say you will marry me. Say you'll become my wife. He tells her that he was nervous because he didn't think he could marry without his daughter's permission, but he was mistaken to put Sheila in that situation. She deserves everything. I want it. I want you. Sheila tells Deacon he's making it difficult not to say yes. He encourages her to accept his proposal. He will care for her and spend the rest of his life making her happy. Sheila can't spend the rest of her life keeping their connection a secret. Deacon is proud of them and what they've accomplished despite all circumstances. He knows hope and the others will come around. Well, screw them. He shouts from the terrace that he loves her and wants her to marry him. Sheila laughs. I understand. I believe you. She accepts his marriage proposal and the two kiss. Sheila exclaims. I love you. Deacon assures her. I love you too. They kissed again. Adi. At Forrester, Liam informs Steffi that Sheila's death frees up some emotional space. She agrees. She and Finn can now relax and concentrate on their family and future. She'll never understand his attachment to his mother, but she knows he adores them. Steffi believes he is ready to move on from his birth mother. More photos. BNB stars with their real life relationships. At Deacon's house, Hope admires her father's detective abilities. Finn explains that if it weren't for Deacon, Sheila would still be in the warehouse. Hope says, just wait until everyone finds out. Finn believes Steffi will understand that Sheila gave her life to defend her and the children. I think she'll be relieved that she didn't kill my birth mother. He has to trust that one day he will be able to communicate with Steffi, who will understand his desire to have his mother in their lives. Finn tells Hope that he makes a living by saving people's lives. He believes in the healing and growth potential of both the body and the soul. He believes in Sheila and believes it is time to move forward from the past. She's reformed. Hope believes the entire event is quite fantastic. Finn hopes to make Steffi see this, and he thanks Hope for supporting him. I appreciate you. Hearing me and not thinking I'm nuts. Hope could never have imagined that and she is grateful he is willing to share with her. She says she's accessible if he wants someone to call. He tells her she is the best and pulls her into a hug. Come here. Now he's returning home to see Steffi. He believes it will all work out. Hope adds, for your sake I hope so. Outside, Deacon and Sheila sit at a table, holding hands. She will not take this for granted again. The little pleasures are all she requires. What a difference a day makes. Deacon smiles. You've got that right, Mrs. Sharp. Sheila prefers the sound of that. They kiss. Deacon informs her that she will face similar situations throughout her life. They discuss her being locked up and his inability to shake the idea she was out there. Now you're next to me. I'm engaged to be my wife again. Sheila teases him about being engaged to be her husband. He laughs, for better or worse. Sheila feared she was going to perish in that warehouse with no possibility of rescuing Steffi and the children from Sugar, but Deacon has always been there for her. Deacon informs her that her kid will now stand by her side. Sheila exclaims that she finally has a family. She only wanted to be truly loved. 
I feel like I don't have to go through life on my own anymore. They kiss. A.D. JMW considers family addition. Steffi hopes that Deacon's fantasies will come to an end at Forrester. Her spouse will not put her or the children in danger. She apologizes for babbling and thanks Liam for allowing her to vent. She says she's going to see Finn. Tonight is all about reconnecting. More Scott Clifton's son Ford in photos. Later, Hope is working alone in the boardroom when she pauses and sighs. I can't believe my father was right. Sheila is alive. She flashes to telling Finn about Steffi's reaction and appears concerned. Hope Steffi doesn't disappoint you, Finn. More, Jacqueline McInnes would. Can Steffi forgive Sheila? At the cliff house, Steffi lights a candle and pours wine. She grins as she receives a message from Finn indicating that he is halfway home. Finn enters through the door, and Steffi kisses him. She informs him that the children have gone to Grandma Lee's, leaving only the two of them. He called her his beautiful and understanding wife. She offers him drink, but he's fine for now. I'm a little fired up. Steffi observes that he seemed rather distracted this morning. Finn claims he was dealing with something extraordinary, perhaps miraculous. Steffi understands he never considers anyone a lost cause. She appreciates how sympathetic he is. Finn kisses her. He tells her his entire world has changed in the most unexpected way. Steffi wonders. What happened? Tell me. Finn has unbelievable news. And I didn't believe it at first and you probably won't either, but it is incredible. It is truly amazing. Steffi smiles at her hubby with anticipation. Sheila's marriage answer and Finn's dicey mission. The bold and the beautiful spoilers for Wednesday, May 8th show that Sheila Carter, Kimberlyn Brown, accepts Deacon Sharp's, Sean Cannon marriage proposal. After conversing with Hope Logan, Annika Noel, John Finn Finnegan, Tanner Novlin, must inform Steffi Forrester Finnegan, Jacqueline McInnes Wood, the truth. Finn hopes Steffi will understand and feel relieved, but the doctor is mistaken. Keep reading to find out what happens in the next episode of the CBS soap opera. According to BMB teasers for Wednesday, May 8th, Deacon Sharp will propose to Sheila on the balcony of his apartment. Deacon and Sheila left Finn and Hope alone to speak. Fans watched as Deacon proposed marriage to Sheila once more. Sheila is overjoyed that she has been rescued and cannot comprehend what Deacon went through to free her. Furthermore, the search helped Sheila reconnect with her son, Finn. BMB Spoiler Sheila Carter's Wedding Answer On Wednesday, May 8, fans will see how Sheila reacts to Deacon's marriage proposal. Deacon is overjoyed that Sheila is alive. Deacon also believes Sheila has become a better person. So, will Sheila tell Deacon that she is going to marry him? Could there be an unforeseen twist? John Finnegan's Bold Mission The bold and the beautiful spoilers for Wednesday, May 8th reveal that Finn is preparing to depart on a new assignment. Finn helped Deacon find Sheila and save her life. Finn believes Sheila's account about Janet Weber, alias Sugar, Kimberlyn Brown. Finn is confident that Sheila has changed. However, Hope Logan, Annika Noel, does not appear to be so certain. Hope is being supportive. At the same time, Hope's expression while hugging Finn was worrying. Could Hope's instincts about Sheila be correct? The bold and the beautiful spoilers include Sheila's marriage answer and Finn's dicey mission. Screenshot. The bold and the beautiful spoilers. Wednesday, May 8, 2024. On Wednesday's episode, Finn prepares to tell Steffi that Sheila is still alive and that he helped save her life. Finn told Hope that he believes Steffi will be relieved that she did not kill his birth mother. So when Finn tells Steffi that Sheila is alive, there will be no rejoicing. Instead, there will most likely be a large fight. Will Steffi and Finn's marriage withstand this? It doesn't appear so, especially because Liam Spencer, Scott Clifton, is just waiting for an opportunity to be his former Flames hero. When Liam discovers that Sheila is still alive, and that Finn assisted with her rescue, he will undoubtedly exploit this information to rekindle steam.